Hey guys, Craig and Quasar here, back again with another video, and I've been so excited to record this video because we are playing Ark Survival Evolved Aberration. I cannot wait to play this. I love Ark, it's such a good game, it really is, and there is another world uh, now available on, uh, I think, every platform. I cannot wait to play it, it's going to be kind of basically a full playthrough of it, and uh, I have not played it yet, this is a first look for me. So I've got, <laughs> I've got a few options for spawn point. I'm not going to bother with like character design or anything. I don't care. I mean, I'm playing on my own server. Uh, I will do a multiplayer servers in the future, but we got Fertile Lake 1, Fertile Lake 2, Fertile, Fertile Lake 3, and Fertile Lake 4. All of varying difficulty levels, but I'm going to go for the easiest, which is Portal. Uh, survivor name, Human. I guess that's as good of a survivor name as any. So we're going to spawn. No idea what to ex whoa wow this looks bloody awesome this does jesus christ wow 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 look at this i didn't uh finish the other maps i didn't like uh, complete them or anything i've just never had enough time to get around to it, i guess um so this is i'm, I'm not i'm not an expert on arc this is gonna be how to get started type video but i'm certainly no expert I'm part of the tribe of human. Uh, I'm at the ancient device, it says at the top. Uh, day 1, 50%. Day 50%, night and bloody hell. Look at this. This looks amazing. So, I guess I'll just go and look around, maybe? I don't know. It's been a while since I've played Ark overall, to be honest. But, uh, oh my god, I had to jump through so many hoops to get this DLC. Uh, I had like a, I hadn't updated Ark for quite a while, I had like 120 gigabytes to download. I'm running on a pretty good internet connection, but even with that, 120 gigabytes is no joke. It ain't no joke, so took a while, but I'm finally here. And honestly, the, update, the updates that they've done, very good. The game's are very smooth now. Uh, it's like minimal frame tear, still frame tear there. Oh, they've also added an option to turn V-Sync on, which gets rid of the frame tear completely. Uh, they've improved the graphics a little bit, and it's very smooth. It's very smooth, but that's probably not new new news for you guys, because you probably played. I haven't played Ark in quite a while, therefore I haven't updated it in quite a while. I have no idea what I should do. I'm gonna explore. This is gonna be kind of a this is gonna be a longer video. One second, let me just switch over to the right uh, control settings. Oh, this looks good, man. This does look good. And if I mean they've dropped a day one update already, like day one, as soon as it came out, there was an update. Which, at first, it was annoying, because it was like a, another 10 gigabytes I had to download. But, I mean, the, the art developers are some of my favorite developers, just for how receptive they are of fan feedback. And so far, this looks gorgeous. I'm going to do, like, kind of a playthrough on single player, also on multiplayer, though. I'll probably do two sort of separate uh, series and separate playthroughs. What does this do? Acerbic Mushroom, Auric Mushroom, Aquatic Mushroom, and good old Fiber. Hope she passed those poops easy. That fiber does. So they're not magic mushrooms. They're not poisonous mushroom mushrooms. They're just a range of different mushrooms, I guess. God. Oh, oh my God. I hope you can build a house of these freaking mushrooms. Be like, uh, it's gnomes that live on mushrooms, isn't it? Be like little gnomes. So I'm guessing you need a metal pickaxe for these. Punching them with my fists. Probably not going to succeed. They look cool, though. Um, also, there's a, definitely a horror aspect to this. DLC. There's fr basically xenomorphs. I mean, they they got they made them as close to xenomorphs as they legally could. <laughs> if they made them any more similar to xenomorphs, I think that they, they would have a lawsuit on their hands. But they're pretty much xenomorphs. And uh, I've never played Alien Isolation on my channel, but I'm not a fan of xenomorphs. They terrify me. They're cool though. I mean, if I was going to be an alien creature, I'd definitely pick xenomorph. I mean, acid for blood. Who doesn't want that? But yeah, this is awesome so far. I'm not sure, so I guess we get to building stuff, so you can't, you just sort of fade through there, so I guess we'll start building stuff, uh, I'm a bit out of practice with arc, but I wanted to be kind of, if that makes any sense, I wanted to be out of practice, but oh, we got some fungal wood, who doesn't like fungal wood, um, I wanted to be out of practice on arc, just so this had maximum impact for me, so it was like a whole new world, without breaking into any Frozen soundtrack song. You guys won't want to hear that. So what I'm going to do first, right, how many engrams? I've got eight, so I'm going to wear campfire and stone hatchet. And uh, I cannot remember what you need 
for a campfire or a stone hatchet. What the? Right, so click on inventory. What is that? Fungal wood. That does not look like a nice piece of wood right there. I've seen nicer looking wood, honestly. Um, so I guess I'll get to build. So I need eight thatch and one stone. I like art. It's like Skyrim. I like doing videos in art because it's more laid back. So what did I need? Eight thatch and four stone, right? This is what I've got to go to for thatch, I think. Is it? Is it? No, that's not what I've got. That's fiber. I'm so out of practice. I'm sorry, dude. So this is what I go to go. Got to go to for thatch. You just hope none of those freaking xenomorphs come up and face destroy me. Oh, my health is dropping low. These are hard trees. Jesus. Well, I mean, technically they're like giant fungal objects. Right, let's go. Let's see if we're oh, bloody hell. We got, oh, I need one stone. That'll do. Will these stones work? Please give me a stone. There we go. We got one stone. All right. Apparently we didn't. I heard the I heard the the trigger. I heard the sound trigger, but apparently we did not get a stone. None of these stones will let me pick them up. Let me do it, man. Right, it's not working. So I am going into this with low expectations in terms of stability. Uh, Ark is very well known for its glitches and its bugs, so if you see me morph into the floor, don't be surprised, because it's just Ark. It's Ark at its finest, rather. This is a strange looking wall. Definitely man-made. Can I punch it? No, I can't. Right, I do not know how to get stones. Is this not a place that I can get stones from? Right, my health is dropping very fast. Right, none of these stones will let me pick them up, so I'm looking elsewhere. I mean, there's clearly stones here. The game just hates me. The, ha the game hates Quag and Quasar. Wow. God, this looks awesome. I guess... Th I just continue on, I guess. I guess I'm going to explore. There's no immediate danger right now. Nothing's coming up and going to kill me instantly, I don't think. There's a lot of rocks here, but apparently t I just can't take them. I can't pick them up. Too heavy. Uh, so I'm really not sure how I'm going to build. In fact, I'm going in third person. First person makes me anxious. Uh, I'm not sure how to build a stone pick then. This looks weird down here. Knowing my luck, I'm just going to walk into like the, the highest level base or like boss den. Uh, so I'm going to play cautiously. I'm going to be cautious. I'm, I'm, I've got low expectations for this, but at the same time, I expect it to be good, because it costs £16 uh, in the US, probably $19, $20 maybe. Uh, oh, we got those things, parasinethanethem, whatever they're called. Um, I have forgot the incredibly annoying fatigue system in Ark. It's definitely not the same as Battlefront. Oh, we got some dodos. Let's kick off the new DLC by killing an aberrant dodo. Is that any different to a normal dodo? I mean, its eyes are pretty red. That's kind of scary. Sorry, bro. I don't care if you're aber aberrant. But uh, it's time for you to die. Yeah, there's nothing in that. So I'm just going to... I hope something's not attacking me. What? No, I'm just going to kill this, I guess. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Oh, God. The, the Dodo revolution has begun. Right, let's... They've also improved the third-person attacks as well. They're a lot less glitchy than they used to, so we'll get some raw meat. Right, so we'll craft... I guess we'll craft the stone pick. Yeah, we don't need any... Oh, right, we need one flint. What, how the hell do I get flint or rock when, from bloody things that don't give me flint or rock? These rocks do not work. And somehow I think that, uh, that rock wall there, probably a little bit too hard to chip away at with my uh oh my god oh jesus oh god oh well this is it rest in peace me oh my god aberrant raptor they're like glowy and everything that terrified me fully clenched right now i may need a change of underwear bloody hell that was terrifying um i'm gonna spawn at the fertile lake instead let's see if there's any interactable rocks there because that's what that's the we're on the quest that's what this video is probably going to be called the quest for rocks then again, though, not very interesting of a title. Wow, look at this. I, oh, I like how they've changed up the visual. What the hell is that? They've changed the visual design of everything. Like, they're all glowy and stuff. Look at these. Look how fabulous they look. An aberrant parasol. So this is some kind of alien structure. Wow, this is awesome. This is so cool. Ark's come a long way from, like, two years. Was it two years ago or a year? 
no, two years ago, when it was uh, when it ran at three frames per second and it had the resolution of a potato. Still, the optimization is not perfect, but given the scope of such a game, it's fair enough. I don't know if you can get these. I think they're just for show. I don't know if we can go in and like punch an alien in the face or something. Punch one of the, I can't even remember what they're called. It's big. Oh, what is... We got a force field up there. Oh, my God, look at it. Bulb dog. Hello, sir. Should we find out what happens? I mean, this is an exploration video. So I think we should find out what happens when you attack them. Oh, they run away. That's really sad. I regret it now. Oh, it's really cute. You can see where it's going and everything. Oh, that's actually really cute. That little freaking pugs. What's going on here? Where's he running from? I got really scared then while that noise was, but now it's just the metal underneath me. This is so cool. If only I could figure out how to pick rocks up. Unless they've picked, unless they've changed the controls of some in some way. Wow, this is so cool. But this looks amazing on the X. Wow. Look at that. Jesus Christ. I wonder how big this map is. Like the whole... Oh, what's that? It's one... Oh, that's ugly. I didn't even know they were added to the, the Xbox version yet. That's like a mole rat. Incredibly ugly. I don't know if they're pred predatory though. Oh, what's that down there? Oh, well. I was glitched then. I was about to give up on life. I don't know what that was. Glowy blue thing. But, uh... I'm staying away from that mole rat. Not, not only do its teeth look very big, it's very unattractive. So this is the fertile lake. Mm, yeah, it looks quite fertile. wonder what the equiv equivalents are of the obelisks or obliques, is, 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 whatever they're called. Uh, I wonder what they're going to be in this. I don't know if they're even in this, to be honest. Ooh, what is, oh, what? Oh, wait, never mind. It's just crystals. The crystals. How do you get rocks? God, oh my god, this looks awesome. Oh, is that a spino? That is a spino right there. That is a gloat. That looks like a freaking highlighter pen. Oh my god, they look amazing. I believe he's seen me. Oh, we got. Is that a raptor over there? That's a fast moving. Oh, it's one of those annoying horse things. Look at that spine. That looks amazing, right? I'm going to crouch down and then we're going to apply this skill point. I guess. What should I go for? I guess I'll go with speed or stamina. I'll go with stamina. We've got seven, so I guess we'd go with those two. Seems, how is he not. Why is he not glowing anymore? He was glowing, but now he's not. I don't know. Oh, what the hell is that? I don't even know if they're new to the DLC or not. I haven't played Ark in such a long time. They're really ugly, so I don't think I should go near it. That is, Jesus, they're ugly. There's like mini versions of those alive today, isn't there? So, we're still on the quest for rocks. I have received no rocks so far, so what's that? Note. I do not want to craft a note. Seems pretty easy. So like it's, it doesn't seem super intensive and super difficult so far. Um, oh yeah, I lost all my stuff, didn't I? God damn it! Well, that's rather annoying. I guess I'll find some more thatch and more stone. So it's a third person, so that one of those freaking mole rats doesn't come up and chew my face. I don't think they are pred predatory because I think they would have killed that freaking horse thing if they were I'm gonna stay frosty I'm just keeping an eye on that spino as well I wonder what those how powerful those uh, mole rats are I don't even know what they're called honestly I'm guessing they're mole rats um, but I'm not sure let's kill another dodo just for good luck I really want to see oh my god that spine is big I really want to see the new thing. I think it's called Rock Drake, I believe. I really hope these things aren't aggressive, because I'm screw screwed if they are. 
I'm, I'm guessing that if you punch them, they probably will turn rather aggressive, but they seem quite friendly currently. Which is always nice. That freaking Spino. Chilling out of that. I, uh, did we just get a rock? Did, oh, finally I got a rock. Okay, what is with it? Why is the rock system glow? What the heck? Something's shaking. What the hell is going? What the? Something's shaking. That sounds not very good, if I'm going to be honest. Oh, what are these? Green gem. Oh, it's like ruptures that release gems. Well, I'm going to make a nice necklace later then, now that I've got those gems. I'm joking. I don't, don't think that's a component of the game. I really like the effect. I mean, for, for that, it kind of just looks like that thing's got stretch marks. But for the spino and stuff, making it glow, that's really cool. Or maybe the water's radioactive. I don't know. We'll find out the soundtrack's nice as well. Alright. We've got a pickaxe. We need. Oh! Ooh, hello. wonder if these are cool. Like. Oh, we got crystals. Alright. Let's whack away at this. I guess we'll go. Oh, God. Alright then. If there's any Ewoks up there, they're screwed. Uh, I guess I will. Do my best to build a base. We'll set up a sort of a starter base location. Well away from here, though, because there is a radioactive spine in there. Um, you swallowed some, I don't know, like, freaking... I can't even remember. What's that stuff called? That neon gel stuff. Glow bracelet things? You swallowed one of those, I think. Uh, so we'll get to... I just got... I guess I just got to keep gathering. Craft stuff. Uh, level up until the point when I can make a uh, make a base make a, a, a thatch base they've actually improved the textures of the player character as well so we need fiber we need a lot of fiber for those does it turn night time or is it just like universe oh whoa they are magic mushrooms what how am i suffocating what what on earth is going on how am i suffocating what the Jesus Christ. Okay, no, they are magic then. What on earth was that? That's cool though, because I mean, you know, there's some people out there that just, if there's mushrooms in the DLC and they're not magic, then they're just going to get annoyed. What the blood? Oh, these are like different mushrooms. So don't go near the one, no, don't go near what, those ones. And we picked those. So yeah, I'm not going to ingest those. Probably having them on my person in my inventory. Probably not a good idea. Uh, this strange gem is used as a crafting ingredient in primitive tools and saddles. Okay, good to know. Let's chomp down some... Let's chomp down some berries. What's that? That mushroom's good, I guess. Those mushrooms are good, but those ones are not. Do not get those confused. And obviously, knock. I'm not that much... Oh, it's night time. It is night time. I don't know if those beast things come out at night time or not. Hopefully it's not too dark on the... Uh, I'm hoping it's not too dark on the uh, on the screen for you guys to see. I'm just checking. No, it should be good. It looks okay, actually. Just give it a bit of a check there. So, I don't know if those beasts come out. Oh, is that a raptor? That is a goddamn raptor. Is that a raptor? Yeah, that's a raptor, and that, that I don't know what that thing is there, but that thing doesn't... Oh, that's one of those uh, iguanodon things. Um, oh, those are some bad mushrooms. So I guess I will get on to building a... Building a torch. We'll try and build one of those, since it looks like an inherently dark uh, DLC. So build one of those torches. Uh, we need one flint. One flint is all we need. Then we will be set. Yeah, I wonder what the map size is for this mod. I've never played through all the way through any of the arc maps since I spent you know fifteen ninety nine on this. I'm, I'm I'm anticipating playing all the way through it. I'm also uh, looking forward to playing some multiplayer of it. Like multiplayer servers. Generally, I'm not good. Multiplayer at, at multiplayer servers just they they frustrate me they really do. 
Just getting killed by some dude on a freaking spino or something when you're level one. It's ooh, nice ass. Uh, it's really annoying generally, but uh, I'm figured I'm gonna give it a go. So there's a spino there. There's a raptor there, and I'm not going anywhere. Oh no, scorpion! All right, let's run away. Do they only come out at night or something then? No idea, but I'm not going near it. I'm gonna go and build a base. Probably don't want to build near crystals because that will affect the future, the spawns of future uh, crystals. I don't think it followed me. Right. Step one, let's find a good place to sort of hold up and bog down. I guess we'll build some clothes as well. Actually, no, let's build a spare because if something uh, runs up on me and surprises me, it'll be good to have a spare. Then again, it'll probably break straight away, but I don't know. It's better than nothing. Right, so armor should be the next point of all right, fiber. Yeah, we just need fiber then. Uh, we get those by these little things. I just have to be careful not to trigger any of those Any of those mushrooms. That is bad. That's some bad mojo literally <laughs> Do not want to do that. Does this not give you fiber anymore? Oh, yeah, yeah, it does It's shaking again. Oh, it's like probably night. Oh, that looks really cool I'm just gonna stay Stay alert because that scorpion's down here somewhere. Oh, where did the spino go? I don't think the spino's going to cause me too many problems. Not here, anyway. Because we've got the para over there. But two of these crazy freaking ugly mole rat things. So I think we're good for now. I'm just going to focus on building up a little bit of armor. Just to give us a fighting chance if one of those aberrant raptors attacks. Also, we've got plenty of berries now as well. They've also made the, the fire. They've increased the resolution of the fire as well. So the fire uh, looks more realistic, which is cool. I'm really, really anxious as to where that uh, sp spino's gone. Shut the hell up, Dota. You're creeping me out, bro. Right, we've got enough for that. And how much do we need? Right, we need 25 more fiber, and we'll be able to get the trousers as well. And now we can unlock thatch buildings, which is very nice. I'm just gonna craft enough for. God, I look like a shadow person right now. Look at, look at, look at me. Uh, I'm gonna craft a pair of trousers again, just to give me a fine chance. Where the hell is Mr. Spino gone? I wonder how you can get. It. I, I guess you could swim across there, but I don't know. There's probably like saw teeth salmon in, or saber teeth salmon in there. Right, let's craft that. I'm so terrified right now. Oh, bloody hell, those things are terrifying. They really are scary. I see a raptor over there as well, so I'm going to avoid Mr. Raptor. Roger the raptor. Right, let's equip that, equip that. Do another one for health. Thatch. Right, we'll just do the most important things. We can't build a... S oh, God, those things are so terrifying. They will never wear off on me how ugly and scary those things are. So I'm just going to keep crafting stuff. I guess we'll craft some more spares. I'm going to build a base once it turns daytime. Because I'll be able to observe the situation a little bit better. You know, there could be a raptor around the, the other side of this tree for all I know. Um, so if I... Oh, gems. So if I build a base here, probably not a good idea if there's a raptor there. So I'm going to wait until... Please don't attack me. Oh, no, it's attacking me. Okay, no, it's, it wants to kill me. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Why is it attacking me now? Did I get too close? What did I do? I'm screwed. These things are ugly. Leave me alone, oh goes. I can hear them. It's bloody terror. Oh god, it's terrifying, honestly. Jesus Christ. Ark, God save me. Oh, come on, Jesus, I'm scared. Oh god! Jesus Christ. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, please don't get up there. Yeah, I, I just pooped myself. I'm that scared. Oh god. Oh god, I'm running. The music's scary. Everything's scary. What is this? What is the mole rat's problem? Racism. Please don't still be after me. Bloody hell. This thing's already scaring the crap. Oh, God. What's that? We've got a raptor up there. Maybe it's a dialo. I don't even know if dialos are in this deal. Jesus Christ, it scared me so much. There's... 
Are they? Is it coming after me again? I don't even know. Oh, yep. No, yep, 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 yep. Okay, I'm screwed. God damn. These freaking things, they don't give up. These things do not give up, do they? Jesus Christ, and I'm thirsty now. So I've got to go in the spino pool, which is not going to be fun. Eat some berries just to uh, stay hydrated. Jesus Christ, is it still after me? Seems as mole rats have a good memory then, I guess. Jesus, so we're not going that way. <laughs> we we ain't going that way. What's I don't what's the mole rats problem? I don't even understand. I don't understand. How do I get up there? That looks cool. That looks safe up there. It looks warm. I just want to go where there's no mole rats, honestly. Why did they have to add mole rats to the game? It was not scary until they added that. Now it's terrifying. I don't think you can attack these with normal pickaxe. No, you just get stone. Bit of a waste of a... Bit of a waste of a... Perfectly good crystal, so I'm not going to do that. Right, let's see if we can craft another uh, spear in case there's freaking mole rats. I don't even know how tough the mole rats are. They didn't seem to do a lot of damage when they did grab a hold of me. Oh, God! Oh, my God, these freaking mole rats! Oh my god, you moron. I hate you. Stupid morons. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. My heart's going so fast right now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Jesus Christ. Bloody mole rats. They're so annoying. I'm so scared. Jesus Christ. Honestly, I may need new underwear after that. Jesus Christ. Are they watching me now or something? From underground? Bloody hell. I'll go get some more berries or something. Maybe it was the torch that startled them. Maybe that scared them. i got to heal up though. Because those mole rats come back around. I'm screwed. Right, I see a mole rat over there, but I don't think it sees me. Coward. That's right. You're a coward. Right, I'm not injured anymore, so it means I can sprint. Not really anything that I can eat right now, though. Need to kill me some more dodos. I'm just going to avoid the mole rats for now. Honestly, this this DLC, it's a horror DLC. I don't know what those things are that are floating, but they're probably... Everything wants to kill you. It's unlike all of the... All of the other things, right? Do these things want to kill you? Yeah, no, they will want to kill you because the bugs in the other thing and the other DLC want to kill you, don't they? I hope Mr. Spino's not over anymore. And it's the, uh, this thing looks like it's following me, to be honest. God. This is a scary freaking DLC, man. Jesus Christ. So that's two jump scares. No. Two, yeah, two jump scares so far. I need like a jump scare counter in the top left hand corner of the screen, don't I? Jesus Christ. The water looks good. They've definitely upped the resolution of the water. Now, knowing my luck, Mr. Spino is going to be around here somewhere just waiting for me. We've got one of those. Those bulb. Oh, what's lying up there? Those bulb dogs seem incredibly useful. I'm guessing they eat meat or maybe fish. Maybe I can... Should we try and tame one? Shall that be the focus of this thing? So we're going to go and find a dodo to kill them. Um, I'm guessing they want meat. If they want meat, then that's all good, because I'll just find a dodo. Is it getting light? Please, just someone make it light. Oh, I see the spino. The spino is under there. I see him swimming around. What a douche. That is terrifying. That is so scary. Oh my god, that's scary. I think they've added that. That th The Spinos did not used to swim around like that. They've added that. Maybe not in this DLC, but in, in, in one of the updates. Of which there have been many, so... I don't know which one it was. 
I'm going to have to head up there then. Where's Mr. Spino? It's so creepy how you just see the fin moving around. They do look cool though. I guess that's because the water. I guess he's glowing because of the water then. Honestly, everything just feels hostile. 50% <laughs> day, 50% night. It doesn't bloody look 50% day and night. Jesus. It looks rather night right now. Yeah, I'm guessing those bulb dogs eat meat. There's no way I'm going in there to get fish if they eat fish, though. Screw that. Not with Mr. Spino in there. Oh, God, what, what are those? Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I don't know what that is behind me, but... Gee, what the... What the hell? Ravager. What even is a Ravager? What is a Ravager? Jesus Christ. Is that... I'm guessing that's something that's exclusive to this DLC. Right, so this... God, this is all... This is so hard. Well, I lost all my stuff. That's not good. This looks different. Oh, we've spawned at the portal, that's why. Okay, well, I'm screwed. Okay, I'm going to end the video there. It's been nice trying it out. I will do more videos in this. Um, I know I haven't really accomplished anything uh, in this episode, but it was an exploration type thing. Also, I think my mistake was trying to move out off into the you know the 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 harder areas, the more difficult areas, with the, with nothing. So I think the better thing to do would probably be I don't know what these guys can do. I don't know if they can fight. Oh god, they're so cute. I don't know if they can fight at all. But I'm definitely gonna tame me one of these. Next video. Uh, build a few spears instead of just one. Uh, <laughs> build a whole set of armor instead of just a t-shirt and a pair of trousers. And I'm going to stay in this location. I'm going to stay in this area. Uh, it seems like they've given you this area to spawn in for a reason. God, those aberrant lystrosaurs. They look so cute. Um, but yeah, it seems like this area is here for a reason. God, look at all the glowing dinosaurs. Look, this is really, really cool. Um, so yeah, I'm going to stay in this area. Probably build a base in this area, actually, as well, in the next episode. So, uh, that's the plan for the next episode. Build a base. Avoid the stupid goddamn mole rat and, uh, cra uh, tame one of those bulb dogs. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed a, f a quick look into Aberrant, or, ab no, Aberration, definitely, uh, leave a like on the video. It would really help me out, and I'd really appreciate it. If you want to see any more of my videos, definitely stick around and subscribe. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.